Good morning, everybody. It is 740 right now. Welcome back to Iowa Live. Lou and Jackie here talking about an organization that we really love to support. And they have something going on next week that's really fun. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Ronald McDonald House is the organization we're talking about. And Pedal for the House is the wonderful event coming up next Saturday. So start marking it in your calendars. Very excited to have two wonderful ladies helping to make this happen this morning. We do have Shelly Randall. She is Ronald McDonald House Special Events Coordinator. So you yes. get to have all the fun when yes, it comes to Ronald do. McDonald House. <laughs> House. Yeah. And then Don G uh, with Bacaris Roofing, uh, you're a presenting sponsor yes. uh, for this wonderful event. So thank you both uh, for joining us today. Yes. Thank uh, you for having us. Remind us of the great work that uh, Ronald McDonald House does for families literally every single day of the year. Um, so we are a place where families can go to be close to each other. Um, our motto is keeping families together during a crisis, during a medical um crisis with children and we provide a safe um, house for them to stay in and it's their home away from home is what we say yeah. um, so they get to be close to the medical facility and their family while they're dealing with this and it really does make a difference when uh, when families don't have to worry about where they're going to be definitely. when they can be so close to their child right yes definitely Definitely. And we're very blessed yeah. to be uh, living in Des Moines, but quite a few families have to come in to right. the wonderful Some facilities yeah. that we have, and yeah. this gives them a location to hang out. And we were there for the grand opening of the new beautiful house, and we understand you're expanding even more to another location, We correct? are. In December, we are actually opening a new house in Mercy One Hospital on the fourth floor. Oh, it's wow. an, we're adding an additional 14 bedrooms, so that's exciting. Yeah. So but you, we'll it also can tell that there's a need there yeah, uh, is definitely. what that shows as well. So we want to make sure we can uh, have a bed for a family if they're in need or any other assistance that we can give them at that time. So that means that a little fundraising needs to happen as well. Yep. So let's talk about what's happening next Saturday. All right. So Saturday, August 17th, we are doing our eighth annual Pedal for the House. Um, it's a bike ride, all ages. Um, it's going to go through like the central part of Des Moines. So we start at Captain Roy's. We'll hit up um, Peastery Brewery and Madhouse Brewery. We'll have lots of fun games and raffles and giveaways. We have an amazing Stella Artois um, cruiser bike to give away. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Woo. So that's, that's fun. And it looks like you kind of have an Aloha yeah. theme. theme. A luau. Yeah. A luau. Yeah. 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 And so we will actually have a um, word scramble along the way. So each stop that you go to, you'll be able to collect letters and then you guess what the phrase is. Okay. Yep. So, so little games along the way. Chance to win some prizes. Yep. That's great. Right. But Bacaris Roofing has been part of this uh, for a little while here. Why is it so important to get involved in a cause like this? Um, I think every business needs to pick something that they want to help out. Um, we decided to do Ronald McDonald House because um, it's touched a few of our lives that work there. Uh, my grandson had, been, had used Ronald McDonald House in Iowa City. And so we um, discussed it as a team and chose the Ronald McDonald House. So we decided that we would um, sponsor the bike ride because Jeff, the owner of Bacaris Roofing, is an avid biker. Mm -hmm. Bikes a lot and he's kind of gotten his employees to get in on that. So we really enjoy doing it, and this is our fourth year sponsoring. Um, so it's it's great fun. It's and we did the luau theme uh, the couple of years ago. We were out at the trestle trail yes um, and then we decided to move it to captain roy's so that people wouldn't have to drive as far i was gonna say um, i've done the ride before and i've it's usually on the trestle trail so it's yeah. good to, and important to know for people to realize it's yeah it's and here so back in town bit, yeah. yeah and so last year was our first year at captain roy's and it was a great success um, everyone had a great time we went to mullets and um, confluence and then back to captain roy's and so this time we decided to stay a little more in the east village area okay. to promote that area of town and right. some of the places there um, a lot of bikers like to go through that area so yeah That's great trail don't I want to ask you about yeah. your family because you mentioned that this particular cause mm -hmm. has touched your family mm -hmm. directly uh, what was so important about Ronald McDonald House when you utilize their services um, it was a place for my it, it's my grandson that was there and um, he was in Iowa City and there his mother and father are from Des Moines so it was a place that they could stay without having to worry about all the expenses, um, you know, like hotel and mm -hmm. driving back and forth and all that. So they um, gave them a room and they stayed there while, you know, the procedures were being done or hospital stuff, you know, seeing doctors and things like that. Right. Just, and a lot of families that, that have medical expenses. I have a daughter myself that had open heart surgery. Luckily I was in town so I didn't have to use that facility. but. Um, it's a lot of stress on families and mm -hmm. when they're able to go use something that is given 
by the community, it's it's a great relief. Yeah, a little comfort of home. Nice. Yeah, and even things like meals, you know, right. they can stop in and eat and, you know, just have some place to sit. And then there's other families that are going through the same things that they have someone to talk to that they can relate with. So Right. Yeah, now, that. Shelby mentioned there was a husband and wife situation here who had a place to stay in Iowa City for that. How big of families uh, can the Ronald McDonald House accommodate in case the families want to come over? Yeah, definitely. So right now we actually have a family with um, five kids, and wow. they're all staying with us in the Des Moines House. Wow. So we can accommodate pretty much anything. Quite well, a few. That's impressive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. yeah, and that's why we need to continue to mm -hmm. support this amazing facility. Yeah. So still time to sign up yep. to be a part yes. of the ride. Yep, definitely. You can go to our website um, and sign up. We have registration on there. Okay. And um, if you pre-register, you actually get a little discount. So a little incentive on there. there. And, sign up. Yeah. And, yeah. and just a friendly reminder, the gala is not too far away that's as well. Right. If you'd yep. like to get your tickets uh, now for that and be a part of another that's beautiful cool. evening uh, helping to support the Ronald McDonald House uh, that we have here in Des Moines. Now yes. you mentioned the, the new facility uh, yes. that's going to be opening up. When, when is the, the target opening date for that? It's December. It is going to be December it, yep. of this year. Mm -hmm. and, and it's coming along. We, I was just there a couple weeks ago and it's looking good. Like it's definitely like a changed floor so wow yeah it's really neat you're able to incorporate right there because I don't know if you can get it much closer than that exactly so that'll be absolutely perfect yeah um, you know how does that make you feel to be able to provide this type of service for some people that they can just take that part of the stress that's right. involved with a hospital stay of their child yeah. and just put that aside and say now we can focus on the kid yeah it definitely makes my job um, you know feel good worthwhile like I love you know giving back to the community and helping in that aspect um, it's fun to always it's good to always go to a job where it makes you feel good to do the work that you do absolutely well Shelly thank you for joining us today Don thank you mm -hmm. and what, for what your company is uh, doing to give back in a, a huge way uh, with the pedal for the house so give us all the details once again so we get as many people there <laughs> as possible all right so it's Saturday August 17th um, registration starts at 3 and the ride is from 4 to 7. We're going to kind of go around Central Des Moines and do little stops, um, raffle tickets, fun prizes. Um, you can go to our website which is rmhdesmoines.org and pre-register. There we are. And get more details uh, on Facebook yep, and just Facebook. make sure you're part yeah. of the what's happening with the Ronald McDonald House because great things are definitely happening there. If you have a passion yeah. for giving back, a passion for biking, or just a passion for having fun, mm -hmm. you can do that next Saturday. Yep. I like to throw in a little note too. Um, we do have the raffles and if any companies or anybody wants to, you know, donate something to be raffled off to help raise money that they're welcome to do that. Just get a hold of them at the house. Still opportunity to do yes. so if you want to be yep. a part of this in an mm -hmm. even bigger way. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Well, yeah. thank you both for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you for, Thanks for having us. Great things are happening in our community. We're